Hi friends, welcome back. I hope you all are getting ready for the holidays. Uh, I have a um, quick and easy card for you today. And if you have not still started on those holiday cards, you still have time. And um, this one is very quick and you can still get this one done in time. Uh, for today's project, I have used stamps by Penny Black. And uh, the uh, stamp, the, the bent stamp and the sentiment stamp, I will leave a link below um, in case you want to check it out. This card is pretty simple to do, there's not much to it, um, but I will definitely go over the supplies with you. And uh, for uh, today's project, I have used 140 pound uh, watercolor paper, it's by Strathmore. Uh, the watercolors are by Sakura, they're Sakura Koi watercolors. The brush is the number four, it's a Kolinsky Sable by Vincent and Newton. And, um, jar of water some tissues to wipe off and uh, you're on your way with the supplies um, apart from that I haven't done any sketching um, it's a very simple background that I have done uh, cold winter scene and uh, to stamp the image I have used a memento uh, tuxedo black I have not used a distance ink this time because I didn't want the ink to spread um, apart from that I haven't really uh, taken too much care to stamp it perfectly you can see that it is missing a little bit and that in fact helps me when I add the watercolors there um, and uh, uh, for masking the edges I usually use painters tape or um, regular watercolor uh, masking tape uh, but I was out of it so I have used post-it notes um, you can use either it doesn't really matter as long as it has a low uh, adhesive on it and uh, that was primarily to give me a clean border outside and also i wanted this entire painting to kind of fit in the middle of my um, paper rather towards the edges and that is why i decided to use um, a masking of some kind to mask off the edges and um, that's all that there is to it no sketching nothing it's just one single stamp and you're on your way so i hope you give this one a try um, for now i'll leave you with some holiday music and uh, watch me paint So here you can see that I've turned the paper a bit just to add the shadows and uh, I peeled off the post-it notes and once I was uh, done with that it gave me a better idea on how the actual picture looked. I stepped back a bit and then I observed and added a little more as and were needed and uh, this is the stamp set uh, it's again by Penny Black and uh, I'm using the piece on earth sentiment there and I've used distress ink walnut stain to stamp. 
and um, again I'm taking a different brush a slightly stiffer brush and using white uh, paint and um, just splattering over uh, the entire picture and that gives me um, the look of snow um, I didn't I uh, must say do as I tell you not as I have done I removed the post-it and then I realized I had not uh, done the splatter part and um, it was easy to wipe off because it was white on white but uh, truly let the mask remain in place and then splatter and then remove the mask um, also I felt uh, like it was missing something in the foreground and I decided to add a little bit there and uh, for the sake of that I used the mask again I used the postures again to give me a straight edge and uh, I believe that completes this one. It was so easy and so simple to do. Very quick. There was not much. At the same time, it gives an intense depth. And um, once again, if you hope so, I forgot to put the red bird there. And I thought it needed a little more. So I added the little uh, red bird. And um, a little more white paint over the bench and the trees. Uh, to give it that added snow effect. So that is what I did off camera and I really hope you enjoyed this one it was very quick easy and fun to do give it a try I'm sure you will enjoy it thank you so much for joining me today and have a wonderful holiday